This is Trevor Tierney, and this is our partner passing drill at Goalie Evolution Academy. This drill is a great way to get warmed up with another goalie on your team, um, and it's a really great way to just get your hands moving. So in this drill, what we're working on is getting in your stance and keeping your hands under the plastic. You're not dropping your hands down on the stick to throw the ball. We're working on keeping our hands where we make the save. So get those hands, we want to get those hands out in front of us, so out uh, arm length ahead of us and keep your stick in your fingertips so you can uh, catch with soft hands you want to be you want to be able to see the ball where you save it so by keeping that stick out in front of you you get to see the ball where you save it next keep your hands flat so we really want to try to keep both our top hand and our bottom hand on the same plane we don't want to get let our top hand get in front of our bottom hand or our bottom hand get in front of our top hand. And then also keep your feet planted. Like I said before, we're just working on our hand movement here in all six spots on the, on the save. So we're not trying to step or anything here. We're just working on catching and throwing the ball quickly. We're working on the muscle memory of our stance here. So getting down in our stance squatted down low, getting our hands up and away from our body. We're working on catching on what we call the three level. So that's what I've been saying up to this point, is getting your hands out. If you were to picture a plane of glass out about three feet in front of both Ryan and I here, that would be our three level. And we wanna catch that ball out on that plane of glass every time. And this is a great drill for perfecting hand movement and stick work. We want to make this as simple as possible. So as we go through this drill in slow motion here, we can go back over some of those things here that we were talking about. So we're in our stance, feet nice and wide, knees bent, back flat, hands out in front of us, about three uh, arm length in front of us, and our hands should be about chest width apart on our stick. Next, we're staying in our stance the whole time here and not, and not moving. We're also keeping our hands out in front of us. So keeping those sticks in our fingertips here, not trying to catch the ball behind us like an attackman would, really trying to catch the ball with soft hands so we can see the ball where we save it. Next, keeping our hands flat. So you'll see in all the saves we're doing, we're going stick side high, off stick side high, then stick side hip, off stick hip, then stick side low, off stick low. On all those saves, we wanna to try to keep our, our hands on the same plane. We don't want our top hand getting in front of our bottom hand. We can get jammed up, our butt end can get caught in the net. Okay, and we don't want our bottom hand to get out in front of our top hand because then we're saving it too close to our body. Again, we're keeping our feet planted the whole time, just working on our hand movement and stick work. We're also working on the muscle memory of our stance. So for those young goalies out there, you know, building up your leg strength is an important part of this drill. As you see with uh, off stick hip here, you can, you can really see that idea of trying to keep our hands flat as possible. Okay, one thing that we really focus on with young goalies is not letting the butt end get behind our body. Right there, I actually did it a little bit. But Ryan's doing a great job of keeping that butt end flat so it doesn't get caught on the net. On low shots, it's even more important to really focus on keeping that stick out in front of you on that three level that we talked about before. So the three level is if you put your hands out in front of you, there'd be a big glass plane right there out in front of you. And you want to catch on that glass plane every time. If the ball gets a little bit closer, maybe you catch it out a foot in front of you, then that's a two level save. And then if you get hit with the ball or catch it right in uh, your body, right next to your body, and let the ball get too, way too close to you, that's a one level save. So we're working on every spot of our, our save motions, keeping our hands out in front of us and trying to catch on that three level. Because if we do that, we're learning to train our brain to see it where we save it. <clears throat> Finally, 
The great part of this drill is we're perfecting our hand movement and stick work and just simplifying the position as much as possible. Okay, if we can, if we can learn to catch a save on every spot, of, any spot that the ball is thrown at, we're gonna be in a really good position to be a good goalie. We're gonna have the fundamentals to be a great goalie. So if you watch this quicker, we're just getting in and out of our stick quick, keeping our hands out in front of us, and making the save. We're going stick side high here, getting it back and forth. Then we're going, we'll be going off stick side here. And we're punching both hands across our body there, getting our stick to that off stick position as quickly as possible. Again, catching it out on our three level, seeing it where we save it. Now we're going stick side hip, keeping our knees bent, keeping our stick out in front of us. One thing young goalies do is as you work lower down the body, you go down to hips, stick starts coming in a little bit closer. Down the feet, even a little bit closer. Then off stick hip, we're punching that bottom hand up and out and keeping that stick as flat as possible. Trying not to turn our shoulders too much, keeping our body square to the shooter. Now on stick side low, really squatting down low and keeping our stick out in front of us, not letting that ball get too close to our body so we can see it where we save it. And then off stick low. So this is a great drill to do uh, with a teammate goalie to get yourself warmed up before practice and games and just see shots on all spots and get your hands moving. So I hope this drill is helpful for you. Work on this drill a lot because it can make you a lot better as a goalie.